What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Daniel. I am back again with another video. And if you are new here, my name is Daniel and I am an idiot. So, today I have something fun planned. I just got word um, from my Ulta app that they are doing like 47 different sales all at once. So naturally last night I'm scrolling my phone and like having a panic attack. I almost ordered online, but I think it would be so much more fun if I took you guys with me and we did a little Ulta haul together. So I'm gonna take you guys with me and let's head on out. new displays. I have not been here in a minute. Wow, they have revamped their elf display. Look at that, y'all. My beloved is back in the 40% off real techniques. I think I need one. 40% off Milani, too. And pure. I need to calm down. Oh, and this is why I'm here. Let's go find that display. Guys, I'm like in heaven right now. I have no idea what to pick. I always go for these shades. Like, I feel like I have 75 of them already. This one is spice. I'm gonna go with this one. It is honeys. I'm literally like in heaven right now in this cocktail place, and I probably need to calm down. <laughs> Do I want more Anastasia lip lipsticks? I feel like now is the time. Like, why not? All right, y'all. We got the goods an hour later. <laughs> I will see you guys back at home for a fun little makeup look using our little Ulta haul. All right, guys, we are back. I did some damage. We have the goods right here. I'm super excited. Uh, they have the best selection. Apparently it is National Lipstick Day. Uh, it's Saturday, I think. I don't really know. But I saw online at Ulta that they had all of these huge sales going on. So I'm like, we need to do an Ulta haul. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. One of the sales that they had going on is buy one get one free lipsticks on some like incredible prestige brands you know my girl Anastasia Beverly Hills was one of them I immediately went into panic mode I'm like their matte stick lipsticks are literally my favorite lipsticks <laughs> lately I've just been really into those they have a beautiful matte finish so like when I saw that sale I'm like <laughs> so I did some damage I picked up four of the matte lipsticks. As you can see, they are all nude. But shockingly enough, they all look a little different on the little tag. I swatched about 50 different lipsticks on my hand uh, and I literally got so confused. I was like, I don't know what I'm doing. Um, in true Ulta fashion, I thought it would be cool if we did a full look, but only with products that I have purchased at Ulta, which is almost everything I have. So I'm gonna go into some stuff that I haven't featured on my channel before, as well as some stuff that I really, really love that I just don't reach for a lot. So I found this Flower Beauty uh, Miracle Matte Lip. The shade is Nude Beach. Whenever something at Ulta has like this yellow sticker on it, that immediately means most of the time it's 75% off of the sticker price. So I got it for two dollars. Oh, the, one of the biggest ones of all. But they had a sale, two for 22, on the beloved Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. So y'all know I had to get them. Um, I'm just gonna waste no time and just... So aside from that, I also got me my favorite Real Techniques uh, Miracle Blending Sponge. These were on sale like 40% off too. So that's great, love that. I probably should have gotten the two pack, but I just cleaned the one that I'm using and I also have another new one from a two pack that I bought not that long ago. That is everything I purchased on this little Ulta haul. All right, so without any further ado, let's get into this look. All right, so to start, let's just prime the 
face. I'm just gonna go into my e.l.f. poreless putty. I don't try a lot of new face products because I know what's working for me is working for me. So I'm just gonna smash that right into the face. Press it in. Um, I normally go into my Guerlain Golds, but I'm gonna go into the Guerlain Meteorites. Finally! We're gonna go into the Wander Beauty Galotion. We're just gonna go in with this. As if I need more luminosity. So I'm just gonna go into my Infallible Fresh Wear. Shake the rub. Um. I also wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about what I'm doing with this channel. And I watch a lot of different things on YouTube. I really like comedy YouTube and I really love beauty YouTube as well. So I wanted to kind of marry those things together, which is why you'll see a lot of like heavy editing and funny moments on my channel. Because I think that's one thing that I would like to do personally. I want you guys to be able to come here and find, you know, obviously beauty content, but also be able to entertain yourselves and laugh at the same time. Cause I'm an idiot. <laughs> Let's go into some cream contour. Let's blend. All right, she's looking even. It is time for some concealer. Elf 16 hour camo concealer. It is so good. <laughs> Always forget to do my cream nose contour because I am who I am. Concealer is blended. Now let's just set her Anastasia contour kit. Mix the two lightest shades together. Let's go into some cream contour. So all of that is complete. So I am just gonna hop off camera really quickly and do these brows, and we will be right back. Brows are on. I feel like I made record time with my brows today. Now it is time to get into the eye look. Just prime these eyes up real quick. All right, so she is primed and ready to go. Today, we are gonna use a palette that I got as a steal quite a while ago. This is the NYX Swear By It palette. I don't know what was going on the day that I went, but I think that they were making this an online exclusive. So when I got there, it was half off, so. Why not? All the colors in here are so beautiful. I've never used it on my channel before, so I really wanted to bring it on now. I want to go into some shades that I haven't used before, making sure that I can kind of tie the look into this Sedona um, lipstick from Anastasia. I'm gonna do more of a kind of rosy toned look. And I think I'm gonna base it around this kind of cranberry shadow right here. This is gonna be a different technique than I've done on my channel before. So I'm gonna go first into the darkest shade that I really wanna showcase. I'm gonna go into a Morphe 321 and I'm just gonna pack this on the outer edge and kind of create the shape that I'm looking for and then blend it out with more colors. Pack that on the outer edge and bring it into the now, I didn't set my primer today, so the pigment is gonna show up a lot more than it normally would. Now, this is not normally the brush that I would pack pigment on with. Why I'm using it, I don't really know. I actually think that I'm just gonna go into a Morphe M514. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna go back into that pencil brush and really create that shape right on this outer edge. I think I'm gonna do a halo eye. That was not the intention, but it is now. I'm just gonna pack that pigment on the inner corner. All right, we have laid down this shadow on this side. So I'm gonna do the same on the other side and then we can focus on blending it out. But do we see like the kind of <laughs> that we're getting from a NYX eyeshadow palette? I'm gonna blend that out with this terracotta type shade right here. Now with these shadows, you do get a little bit of kickback. Now I'm kind of going over top of that cranberry shade to really blend out those edges. So in blending, those two together. Obviously we lost some of the pigment from that initial cranberry shade. So I am gonna go back in to really revive that shade. And then just blend out any harsher edges. 
I think that's beautiful. That's absolutely beautiful. And I think it's gonna look super cute with this on the lips. Let's find just a little metallic to pop in the middle. This is not a color I think I would ever put on this, but I feel like it might look cute. Oh, she cute. Yep, yep. Glad we made that decision. Yep, yep, yep. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. That turns out a hell of a lot better than I thought it would. So, I kind of just want to pop on a little bit of this lipstick right now. Oh, yes. These are my favorite lipsticks, I think, ever. Oh, I'm murdering the game today. I think it's time to finish up the lower lash line. And I'm just gonna go in with this terracotta shade again. Well, this just got a hell of a lot smokier than I initially wanted, but who cares? Now I'm gonna go into a Japanesque 346 brush and just take that cranberry shade initially and just tuck it really close to the lower lash line. I'm obsessed. So I grabbed a couple of my Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On pencils. I kind of want to try to put the purple. Let's see how it looks. Oh, that's super cute. The eyes are pretty much done. Just highlight the inner corner with my teeny little dirty ass little brush. Oh, yep, definitely what this looks like. Beautiful! I just fell so hard back in love with this palette. It's so good. Let me go back into this. It's been about a week and a half or two weeks since I've last used it, so maybe it's a little less goopy. It doesn't seem less goopy. All right. Still not that in love with it. Let's finish up this face just a little bit. I'm gonna go into my Anastasia contour kit. As always. And just reinforce this contour a little bit. Snatched. Time for blue bronzer. Blush. I'm gonna go into my Tardis Pro Glow. I think I'm actually gonna go into a pink blush today. Using that same Tardis Pro Glow palette, I am gonna go into this more like baby pink with my Eco Tools blush brush. Only bad bitches put blush on the tip of the nose. You know what, to keep it in the family, I think I'm just gonna go into Tarte Highlight too. I'm just gonna go into my Morphe M532. I'm gonna go back into the pinkier shade and hope it's blinding. Oh wow. Blush! Blush, where you at? Damn, Gina. You can stay with the rest of them. Um... I always save brow gel for like the third to last step. I don't want powder in my brow gel. So we're gonna go into my Costi -costi. Essence Lash and Brow Mascara. We are almost done with it. Um, but I am very quickly going to just pop on some Coffee Talk lashes off camera. Oh. Dropped them. Yeah, we're gonna go in with Madison again. So I'm just gonna pop on these Coffee Talk lashes with Madison and I will be right back. All right, we have lashes on. Today was not one of the days that my lashes wanted to cooperate, or rather my eyes wanted to cooperate. But we are here, this is the final eye look. She's looking good. I think it's about time to finish up this lip and finish up this final look. Obviously I have the lipstick still on, but I am gonna line the lips just a little bit. Going in with my Milani Color Statement Liner. dropping everything today. I am gonna go right back into my Anastasia lipstick that I got at Ulta today in the shade Sedona. That looks so pretty. I think I wanna top this off with a little bit of gloss too. What y'all think? Uh, this is my favorite gloss right now. The Dominique Cosmetics Lemonade Gloss in shade Strawberry Lemonade. Doesn't have any glitter in it. They're really beautiful. I'm gonna need to order another one very soon because I am running out. Ooh. Now let's just go right into some of this new Morphe Continuous Setting Mist and set this. This is the final look, y'all. Ugh. 
Thank you guys so much for coming on this little journey with me. I am super impressed with this final look. The lipstick is incredible. I'm so happy that I got all of these. By the time this video goes up, I don't think this sale is still gonna be on, unfortunately, but the Anastasia matte lipsticks are just like the best in my opinion. And the Morphe setting spray is incredible. I will explore this little beauty, the flower beauty lipstick in another video or just on my own and I'll let you guys know how it is. Everything came together beautifully. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, if you like me, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. If you're feeling extra generous, make sure you hit the notification bell icon because we are not new to YouTube. We know that the subscribe button doesn't work. So like this video if you really enjoyed this content so I know I can make um, other videos like this. Thank you guys so much for being here and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.